baked camembert with pears and cranberries is a luscious, elegant hors d'oeuvre. Marie Antoinette would be jealous. Preheat the oven to 400 degrees and bring a store-bought box of puff pastry dough to room temperature. Next, mix an egg and a tablespoon of water in a small bowl. Now melt two tablespoons of butter in a large skillet over medium heat. Next, add the pear slices and three tablespoons of brown sugar and saute until lightly softened, about five minutes. Then stir in two tablespoons of dried cranberries. Remove from the heat and allow the fruit mixture to cool slightly. Next, unfold the pastry sheet onto a lightly floured surface and roll it to about an 11 inch square. Cut off the corners to make a circle. Cut the camembert in half using a sharp knife heated with hot water. Now place the lower half of the camembert in the center of the pastry sheet and top with half of the pear mixture. Place the top of the camembert cut side down on top of the pears and top with the remaining fruit mixture. Brush the edges of the pastry with the egg mixture. Then fold the two opposite sides over the cheese. Trim the remaining two sides about two inches from the cheese. Then brush with the egg mixture and fold them over onto the cheese. Press the edges to seal. Place the cheese seam side down on a baking sheet. Brush with the remaining egg mixture. If you have extra time, cut decorative leaves from the reserve pastry scraps. Detail isn't as important as the effort. Roll a few tiny pastry balls to make the picture complete. Arrange the leaves and balls decoratively and brush with more of the egg mixture. Garnish with a little rosemary. Now bake in a preheated oven until it's golden brown, about 20 minutes. Let it stand for 15 minutes before serving. Baked camembert with pears and cranberries is natural born goodness. Go to holidaykitchen.tv for a cornucopia of delicious video recipes.